Well, for the first time in the free national movement's history, there is a woman serving as deputy leader. Party delegates threw their support behind Long Island MP Loretta Butler-Turner in large numbers, securing her position. For her part, Butler-Turner says while she will be driving the party's effort to rebuild, she will also be driven by the party's commitment to equality and the advancement of all Bahamians. Our task is bigger than holding the government accountable. We have to rebuild and expand our support in this country. And more importantly, we must inspire this nation. I am ready to fight. I am ready to fight for the empowerment of every Bahamian child. I am ready to fight for those who will seek to abuse the privilege of governance through the corrupt practices of victimization. I am ready to fight for the future of our Bahamas. The FNM also has a new chairman. He is former MP for Golden Isles, Charles Maynard, who began his remarks by acknowledging the party's defeat, but vowed that the FNM will now become a well-oiled machine. Most importantly, though, we want you to know that there's a place for you. Every FNM. You will see an FNM where every major organ, every association, Every instrument of this party will have a role to play and everyone a chance to participate. Torchbearers, I put you on notice. Women's Association, I put you on notice. Branches from Inagua to Abaco, I put you on notice. 